Last bits of fuel with this music. I'm gonna cry now. Egg has been planted. Hello and welcome ladies and gentlemen. Today I will quickly show you how to steal an F8 lighting from NPCs in 3.16.0 and have a bit of fun with it. Before we start this, I would like to quickly note the ship itself is not quite ready and is more of a placeholder. While flying it you can definitely feel a lot of things are a complete work in progress. Besides everything else it will lack chaff and flares and its hydrogen tank is almost non-existent so your time with it will be quite short as you can neither refuel it nor repair. At this stage of the game this is definitely not intended to be flown by players so don't complain this or that doesn't work. There are multiple ways to make F8 spawn, like forcing UE to go after you or getting an Arlington mission chain from Eckert up to F8, but I've chosen the most reliable and easy way for this tutorial. It is easy to reproduce and you can do it over and over again if you wish so. First thing you have to do is grind up the Vaughn reputation to the maximum level of 6. Vaughn is a criminal side mission giver and his missions will pop up in personal tab. Unlike bounty hunting missions, his reputation grows really fast and on top of that, if you have a friend with the highest possible missions available for Vaughn, they can help you by sharing those and you will max out the rep in a matter of few hours. When you are done with the grind, start looking for missions called an Aeneas task or an extremely difficult task. Those are the same missions with different names and in essence they are criminal side ERTs where you have to kill a hammerhead as your objective. What we are interested in are the escorts of the hammerhead. There is a big chance one or even both of the escorts are going to be F8 lightnings. If you are unlucky and none of the escorts are F8s, just finish the mission and take the next one. Do so until you see an F8 as an escort ship. Once you've found an F8, do not kill the hammerhead. I repeat, do not kill the hammerhead, because the entire point of stealing F8 this way is not to struggle with F8 despawning after killing its pilot. Which will happen if you finish the mission by killing a hammerhead before taking control of F8. After you've found an F8 escort, proceed with the simple steps. Fly close to F8 and let it stabilize around you trying to shoot you down. Eject. At this point, if there are no other hostiles around, they will stop and start stalling in space. EVA close to a fade and get into position above its pilot. The cockpit will not protect the pilot, so use preferred gun to shoot them down. And the moment the pilot is dead, the interaction with the cockpit and the seat will become available. Voila! Click it and enjoy the ship. Something I would like to quickly note once again before you close the video. While you can fly the ship, it is far from being ready. Gun loadout is suboptimal for dogfighting and seems to be targeted versus larger ships, as probably F8 should. Two size 4 laser cannons, four size 3 laser cannons, and two size 3 repeaters. I would recommend moving repeaters to secondary groups so you can manage their recharge and fire independently from cannons. It has four size 1 shields, but they're stealth shimmers, which are great C if my memory serves me well, so the HP pool is not as big as it could have been. It has quite an oversteer, so preparing your aim before releasing hell is quite important. If you do hit though, it is devastating. Watch your hydrogen, you will run out of it. I'm out of fuel! And that's about it guys, I will leave everything else for you to enjoy and experiment with. I hope you found this video useful and I will catch you later. Don't forget to subscribe.